recently you had a Kickstarter helping gain support, for, uh, financially backing your new CD. We're just to the point in our career where, you know, everything is so expensive because we're like in between levels. Mm -hmm. We're not down where we can play, you know, Nashville every night, but we're not selling out arenas. So it's very expensive to maintain where we're at, Back. and everything that we make through our shows gets reinvested in it. So we're like, man, if we don't ha if this doesn't work out, we just didn't know how we were going to make it. Right now, you're in the studio with your fully funded Kickstarter project. <laughs> Who are you working with, producer wise? We are working with Trey Bruce, and um, he's a really well-known producer around town. Um, he has produced for Leonard Skinner, Trace Atkins, to name a few. Who are some of the influential singers, songwriters that have had an influence in your personal sound? Well, for me, um, when I was growing up, I guess Willie Nelson. My grandmother listened to Willie Nelson a lot, so I got to hear a lot of yeah. him and some Johnny Cash. And then my mother loved uh, Elvis, and so there's my influence. Yeah. You've got country and you've yes. got rock, so that, that's for me. Yeah, I, I'm really, a, we're both very eclectic, mm -hmm. so, I mean, I listen to everything from, like, R&B, like, Whitney Houston mm -hmm. stuff, Boys to Men, I listened to that growing up, but, like, to, um, rock stuff, I like, um, like, Alter Bridge and stuff like that, to Hank. Foo Fighters. Foo Fighters, yes. to, like, old school Hank. We just naturally are rock country, mm -hmm. and uh, it just comes out of us. We're bouncing all over that stage and just rocking it. Love and it. Uh, people don't think that because we're a mother-daughter duo. They think we're just this sweet little, sorry, a bug's getting me. <laughs> they think we're this sweet little, uh, and we can be sweet, but we're also very edgy, and we just say we're, we, got, we got some grit, you know? Yeah. And so we just get up there and have a lot of fun, and that'll be what our new music is about, just rock and country. Do you have any dream collaborations? Anyone that you'd love to work with? Prince. Prince, <laughs> wow. You've awesome. said this a million awesome. times. Oh, my gosh. Prince, if you're watching. Prince, <laughs> if you're watching. That's I love you. I or I would, I, would, I would go with Steven Tyler if Prince. Oh, that would be great. Yeah, that's Steven cool. Tyler is pretty he freaking is. awesome. You call, call our it, people, yeah. we'll mm -hmm. have our people, which is us, we'll call you. <laughs> what do you want to achieve? We want to sign with a record, a major record label and be awesome. on radio. And we want to tour and uh, we want to sing in arenas. I know that's a big dream and not very many people make it, but you know what? If you don't ever try, you'll never make it. Right. So we're going to give it all we've got. And if God's willing and we get a lot of favor here with our fans, you know, and record labels, maybe it'll work. Until another experience, I have Allison, Crystal, Two Steel Girls, and Chris Berkman signing out. <laughs>